Yo team, good morning. Welcome back to Monday. Welcome to the weekly vlog. Today we've had a really productive day and it's only 8.30. We've had a PT session, we've been on a run, and now it's time to go and get inked. And hopefully this is the last session to complete that sleeve. So I've got a little bit of the gaps to fill in. I'm gonna get some sort of mandala style to fill in the backgrounds. And we're actually only working the old toe. So it's a really good productive Monday. Hope you're all having a good day. Sit back, relax, enjoy. Let's do this. Yo, 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 tattoo is finished. That's actually my last session booked in for a while. It feels weird not booking another one in, but yeah, that's all good. I'm gonna try and show you a photo, but I'll try and, I'll wait for it to heal a bit, and maybe at the end of the week, slap a whole like video in of, of all the, the whole sleeve finished. Really happy with how it came out. And uh, yeah, I filmed that little edit at the start, and Danny wants that, so I'm gonna go give that to him as well. For now, he's going shower. Probably head to stop. Okay guys, just got in and I haven't received this parcel and I'm thinking it's from Harley over at the workout coach but I'm not sure, so let's check it out. Oi. It looks like he's hooked me up with a few new bits and bobs. I'm not sure if that's a vest or a tee, a white one. Ah, no, no, this is the tee. And is that a new hoodie or tracks? and a hoodie. So I'll pop workout coaches at you in there, go and check them out if you like to look at this product. And if you're watching Harley, big shout out to you, thanks bro. Thank you so much. Can I grab a water as well? Amazing, thank you so much. Cheers for that. Yo guys, what's cracking? Welcome to Tuesday. We are back at Sea Dog Studios. Right behind me there. That's, that's pretty cool actually, isn't it? Uh, yeah, picking up the hoodies. Absolutely gassed about this. I think they're gonna look sweet. And obviously I'll show you how they come out. Okay guys, so we just got back. to show you what we got. Now, like I said, so Sea Dogs were the guys that have done the print for me. Based down in South Sea. Really, really good service good communication with me, back and forth on emails and stuff like that. Really helpful. However, they fucked up my printing. Um, I'll start with the one they messed up. So this was just a plain crew neck. Now, I wanted that on the back, so that was gonna be like real low key, just I could wear that quite casual, but still sort of rep it if I needed to, like the RC Fitness. So they put it on the front. It's not the end of the world, it's still pretty dope. But yeah, that was, a, that was the one they sort of messed up. But these hoodies I'm absolutely buzzing with. So we went grey, body code fitness across the front, RC in the back, really happy with that. Swapped around in black for the white, body code fitness, boom, boom, boom. And then the final one is actually a little crop jumper for Beth just with Riley Curry Fitness on the front, which is pretty sweet. So, I'm happy with how they come out, really, really happy. A bit annoyed about that printing situation. If that was on the back, that would have been perfect. But, it is what it is, it's not the end of the world. Um, and yeah, so, I'm gonna, I haven't even tried them on, I'm gonna try them on in a bit, see what they fit like, look like, hoping they look cool. And yeah, that's something I'd quite like to get into, maybe a bit of printing and maybe make a few, a few more. So, let me know what you think of the hoodies down below. If you like them, give this video a thumbs up. Now I'm about to take you out. Yeah, should we go out for a walk? Right, catch you in a bit. Yo, yo, yo. Okay, so we're repping the hoodie. Come out real sweet, I love it. So, heading to physio now, and I'm already late. Not ideal. I had a really busy morning. Um, I can't really film in physio because it's a uni physio and there's loads of other patients being treated, so I can't really show you what she's doing to me, but she's giving me a load of stretches, a load of mobility work, and then obviously a little bit of a sports massage as well to 
so it helped with that thoracic mobility in my back. So yeah, that's where we're heading now. All right, guys, that is physio done. What I wanted to talk to you guys about, and I wanted to, I was going to make a whole video on it, but we'll touch on it now, is sort of longevity within fitness. So I've only started to realise that now that if I want to stay in this fitness game 10, 15, 20 years, I really need to work on my stretching, my mobility, and my flexibility, because I am all over the place. I've got pains in my back, in my legs, and stuff like that. And that's all from training heavy, lifting a load of heavy weight Monday to Friday, and not really stretching enough, not doing enough CV. So I need to really start reevaluating where I want to take this fitness and stuff like that. So as of the cut on Friday, I'm going to go a lot lighter. I'm going to focus on the form. I'm going to do a lot more stretching and a lot more mobility. I'm going to do a lot more cardio, of course, because we're on the cut anyway. But yes, yeah, so I'm going to really start to reevaluate my training and make some specific days just for stretching and mobility. And it's becoming a big thing. It's becoming more and more known in fitness. But when I started, all I wanted to do was hit heavy weights. And now I'm sort of realizing there's a lot more to it and I need to do a lot more stuff if I want to stay fit, healthy and keep my muscles sort of fit and healthy as well. So if you're that sort of same situation or me a few years back, make sure you're doing stretch and mobility every session because otherwise you're going to end up stiff as an ironing board like me. Yo, 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 welcome to Wednesday. Productive morning, we've already had PT, just went and picked up a Starbs, and then we're heading back. Three more sessions this morning, and then three sessions this evening. I weighed in at 79.9 kilos this morning, which is good news. The goal is 80 before we start the car on Friday, so we're creeping closer, people, we're creeping closer. Uh, today I'm gonna go hit a pool workout with Addy as well, so I'm gonna film a little edit and put that on there here as well, so that'll probably be the next thing you see. Did you see that? We're at Samson's. Where Adzi trains. Adzi's rocking some fresh new Alpha Lee collar. Cut off hoodie and those camo trackies. Fire. Um, yeah, so we're gonna get pool day in. Probably film like a short edit for this video because I know it's gonna be long, but yeah, a little pool day edit from Samson's incoming. Samson's boxed off. I tell you what, the more and more I train there, the more and more I enjoy it. It is a good atmosphere. It's as busy as I've ever seen it. I think I think yeah, I liked it, it busy because when there's other people training wow, around wow, you, nice. pushing themselves, nice. sort of gets you good mentally. So yeah, that was a really good session. Obviously, you saw a little little edit, but yeah, pool day boxed off, and now we're going to get a burrito. Spin you to Mexico. And we're here, well, close enough. That's when it's put. He wanted to park a mile away. Anything else for you? No, I thank you. Good morning, guys. Welcome to Thursday. Today is the final day before summer shredding and we've had a bit of a bad day yesterday. I filmed up into the burrito and then after the workout, felt really sick, not very well. Ended up cancelling all my sessions last night. Just, I don't know, I, just, I kept feeling really ill. So I woke up this morning and I feel a little bit better, still not 100%, but I've had a light like workout this morning and today is the day that we do the Krispy Kreme challenge so not the best start to the day but we're going to try and do it anyway because I know that I'm going to not have that food for 90 days so we're going to get, meet up with Al, go and get a load of Krispy Kremes in and get this challenge done. Yeah. 
Can I put it on the business? Ding, ding, ding. Safety first. So we've got two box of glaze, original, so eight each. And then every other donut, one of each. Adzi's joined the party. He's post tattoo, so he's, he's, you're at advantage already because you're hungry. I'm hungry. I'm not, I was saying to that, so I was saying to Al, it's probably the only time I'm actually not excited. These, to these cream ones, the ones filled, are twice as many calories as That's, the yeah, cream things. We're trying to work out how many calories it is in total. 16 rounds in it. Okay, team, we've got the set up. Two donuts here. We, the, the plan is, let's, let's show you. So we're going to do a glazed, a mixed, alternate, hopefully dust off these two. And we have two more there. We're doing like a two minute break between them ones. No, oh, no break, Addy. Who's going to do that? Who's no, 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 no. Go, go whoever, whoever finishes yeah, no, the... Stop worrying. Whoever oh, finishes oh, first, let's run it. Okay. Then those two, okay? We'll set up the time lapse. Every minute on the minute, because we do fitness, so that makes sense. Goodbye, Bulk. Goodbye. And let's do this. <clears throat> two, one, go. <clears throat> That's a good donut. Brilliant donut. What's the technique here? Rush in or relax them? I don't know. Ah. That's taking a lot longer than I thought it would. <laughs> they do like 10 seconds per donut. I didn't say this, but I don't want to listen. Oh, that's a that's not ideal. It's gonna get dirty very quickly. I'm a I'm gonna go for it. What the hell? These food challenges, <laughs> never a good idea. Who's got an idea with this? Oh, I don't know. I, feel, I, I mean, I feel, I feel sick before now. Jesus Christ. So we did four glazed, four of the random ones, 10 minutes, in, in, in eight minutes. We did it every minute. I got to 10. <clears throat> I got to like eight. eight. Ad's got to six well, and ran out of time. Ad is out of six. We got two, two full boxes of donuts left. As if we thought we were going to get through oh. sixteen donuts. I tell you what, Al said it's going to take us ten seconds to eat a glazed donut. <laughs> <laughs> first, I do that no, one, right? first no, round, no. first round with thirty seconds in, no one's finished a donut. We all looked at each other, saying this isn't going to go down well. It's going to be harder than before. But it's all fun and games. For a good cause, because Summer Strand starts tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, boy! Okay then, guys, so that was the Krispy Kreme challenge. Hope you enjoyed that footage. I decided to make it quite quick and short, a little time lapse, because I'm going to put it in the weekly vlog. But if you want to see sort of more footage of that, then go across to Alex's channel. It'll be linked in below, and he'll show sort of a bigger video, longer depth video. Uh, it was actually really funny, but yeah, we didn't do very well. Pick a couple of lads, see if you can do better than us. I'm pretty sure you'll be able to. Uh, yeah, give it a go and see if you can do better. Yo guys, Friday today. Uh, where did I leave the vlog? I can't even remember. Oh no, yeah, that was it. So we'd finished the food challenge. I was heading back to work for a few sessions and then me and Beth went out to TGI's last night. Didn't get any footage. To be honest, like I said, I haven't been feeling very well. Today I've been absolutely clonked out. I've had four, five sessions this morning. Well, then we had a staff meeting. I've come home for an hour and then I'm back in work again for four more sessions. So... Busy, busy day and I'm not feeling great, so not how I wanted to start some shredding. I'm going to take the weekend off from training and then try and start a fresh Monday. So the next video on the channel is going to be summer shredding episode one, so make sure you subscribe, 
hang around for that. It's going to be a good one. Isn't it, Dogger? Yeah. So, we cut this vlog off here. Hope you've enjoyed it. It's quite a long video, but it is a funny one. Make sure you give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed the food challenge. Tune in for some Australian next episode. It's going to be good.